The man accused of murdering a University of Georgia entomology professor is set to go to trial this week. Prosecutors say Marcus Lillard killed his girlfriend Marion Shockley in May 2019 at the Baldwin County home of a friend. Here's a recap of the case. The Georgia Bureau of Investigation says the first 911 call came in around 1.06 a.m. by Clark Heindel, one of Marcus Lillard's friends and the owner of the home. In the call, Heindel reportedly says Marianne Shockley had drowned but was breathing. Then he later says she was not breathing. When first responders arrived at 1.20 a.m., they saw Lillard and Heindel giving Shockley CPR. EMTs and investigators noted in the incident report in May that Lillard and Heindel's behavior seemed odd and their statements inconsistent. Lillard told investigators he was in the woods getting firewood when he came back and found Shockley unconscious. Lillard believed she hit her head trying to get out of the hot tub and he said he dropped her trying to pull her onto the pool deck. Investigators separated the two men for questioning. At that point, Heindel went into his master bathroom and killed himself on scene. His suicide note said he didn't know what happened to Shockley. An autopsy done at the GBI crime lab found Shockley's cause of death was not drowning, nor was it a contributing factor. It was due to manual strangulation. Lillard is charged with concealing the death of another person, aggravated assault, and the murder of Marianne Shockley. Jury selection is set to start tomorrow at the Baldwin County Courthouse.